the alternate side and, and going over there, it's kind of like, you know, the friends that we've known uh, for several seasons and the characters we've been following, they're sort of our old favorite toy. But now we've got this kind of shiny new toy that's really cool and fun to play around with. You know? What's sort of the, the balancing act to be like, I want to play with this toy, but I kind of really want to play with this toy, but I don't want to neglect this one? Is it, is it kind of tricky to, to hop back and forth and, you know, try and keep it satisfying for both sides? I think that for us, our hero characters are the first three we met. Peter, Olivia, and Walter. And at the end of last season, we left Olivia in the other side. So we have a point of view character to explore the other side of the room. So going over there is really telling the story that we're really compelled to tell. And, and all to Olivia, all Royals, all Astrid, they're really in relation to the characters that we love. So we're telling their story and we intend to and we know their story and it's a question of like how fast we tell it. But for us it's only season three. Yeah. And season three is you know, so so to us the the, the you know the mothership is still the shiny new toy. Yeah. Yeah. And there's certainly plenty of story with both of those universes, but are there other alternate universes you could explore, like visit and... That's funny, we just got asked that same question. Yeah. Um, right now it's two, yeah. you know, because there's so much to explore. Right. You know, and... The possibilities there. Well, in terms of multiverse, yeah, right. really, you know, but just the, 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 the hole between this one and that one is the one for example. Like we said earlier, series television yeah. is so challenging, and it's so challenging when people have so many other things they can do with their time. <laughs> um, oh boy, you yeah, know? that's true. <laughs> so, so, if, so, better be good. Yeah, <laughs> a it better be good, and b it has to be understandable, and it has to be understandable while you're eating dinner, or you know. So, um, you know, it's not like you're in a movie theater and you're and you're you know you're a captive audience. You're really sort of like a, an audience because you want to be captive, and so two feels at this moment enough to, you know, wrap your head around.